Jeff Jacob from Extreme Limousine joins us now, and we have uh, some pretty incredible limos that we want to get to in a moment. But first, we're going to talk a little. You know, parents, Jeff, are worried about safety, and you got you got the background for this, right? Tell us a little bit about your background. You're retired Escondido police officer. Talk to us about that. I am actually. I'm a retired uh, sergeant from the Escondido Police Department. After 20 years of service, I realized that. Uh, with driving and a lot of stress, especially with prom season, and kids are trying to make sure they're having a good time and get dressed and, you know, get everything ready, that uh, we, they don't want to have to worry about driving. They exactly. Keep them safe. Because in your 20 years of experience, I mean, you've seen a lot of car crashes involving kids and teenagers, so you know that this is really the best option for them. On prom night, you can go out and have a good time as long as somebody responsible is behind the wheel, getting them to and from where they need to be, right? Absolutely. Alcohol-free is the big thing. Okay, let's see if we can get some of those safety tips right now. You just said that alcohol-free prom is number one. Why? Obviously, it's illegal for kids to be drinking, but but it, 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 sometimes a little drink here and there just happens. Got to deal with it. It does. And How do we deal, deal with, with it? That. Okay. We make sure we have our drivers trained to make sure there's no alcohol in any of the mm -hmm. vehicles, to make sure that none of the uh, passengers have brought any alcohol with okay. them. Okay. And we can get a hold of the parents if we need to. We swap phone numbers with the parents. Okay, let's go through this list here because you say pre-approved itinerary, responsible point parent. Tell me about that. We make sure that the parents are at the point of pickup so we can swap phone numbers with them okay. so we can keep in touch with them. We also make sure that we get an itinerary from them so they know where the kids are going. We know where the kids are supposed to go and we won't differ from that. Okay, what's uh, keep the partition open? What do you mean by that? Uh, each limousine has a partition divided between the driver and the rear passenger okay. area. We lock that open so the drivers can keep an eye and an ear of what's going on in the back to make okay. sure the kids are safe. And also, never let the kids book the company. Why is that important? Because a lot of kids are going to go online, they're going to see what they want, and then they try to book it. Why do you say don't do that? Very important that the parents know what company they're going with, that it's a good and safe company, and that they're able to keep contact with the company. Okay, now, the tips for picking the correct company, because this is important. This is where kind of you come in with your, own, with your own extreme limousine. What do we look for? You definitely want to look for a company that's licensed and insured. You don't want to go with a company that doesn't have trained drivers. Trained drivers also need to have alcohol and drug testing okay. set with the company. Very, very important. If the cost seems too good to be true, it probably is, and it's a company that's not legal, that's not um, licensed, and they're not going to be safe. So safety number one and also making it a fun experience is important as well, right? Fun is, is it easy to find out all these things about a company? Should they make it clear for parents when they're out there looking for this, not try to hide it? They should make it clear parents need to ask the right questions and check the websites that are available to make sure the companies are licensed. Okay, we were just in the wind, the wind, the West Wind, excuse me, the limo bus, and uh, that fits. How many people? You said that 30 people in this the bus, right? This bus will hold 30 max. My goodness, and then we're inside <laughs> the H2 stretch limo. 18 people in this one. What are some of the unique features of this? Uh, this one actually has a fireplace. It's a... Uh, Simulated fireplace. It has a nice stereo, changing color fiber mm -hmm. optic lights, DVD system. It's wow. got a little bit of everything. So they're all pretty much decked out, aren't they? They are. What do the kids say when they get in one of these things for the first time? The kids love them. The kids just love yeah. them. They even send us letters showing yeah. uh, pictures showing us how happy they were. <laughs> okay, let's talk about this Chrysler 300 because uh, we've seen the normal version of this thing on the road, but this, which is kind of added about 100 feet extra to this car. What's the big wow factor about the, the Chrysler 300 limo? The wow factor on the Chrysler is you don't see a lot of them. This specific one has a Bentley grille with the chrome wheels, and it, uh, it, turn, it turns heads when it comes by. So this has nine. So you get from 30 people to 18, and this one fits a nice, comfortable nine folks. Exactly. Now there's a person missing if it's nine, isn't there? There is. So who doesn't have a date? <laughs> Somebody's going stag in this one. Somebody is going on the road. Okay, it just said, hey, you know what? All the information on this, prom season, you got to be safe. That's the most important thing. Fox5SanDiego.com has all the information. Just click on the scene on Fox 5 button. It's a tradition that we start the engines here. So even though these aren't technically sports cars, but okay, guys, you want to start them up and rev them up? It's Throttle Thursday after all. Limo prom edition. Jeff Jacob, Extreme Limousine. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Go for a ride. Let's do it.